Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of testicular malignant mass. A 24 year old male patient came with left testicular pain. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the measurement. Both testes show normal measurements. But if you compare each other, you can see the left testis is slightly bigger than the right one, which may not be playing much significance here. But you can see the left testis shows an inhomogeneous area at the lower part. So here you can see the left testis with a heterogeneously hypoechoic irregular ill-defined mass at the anti inferior parenchyma. If you look carefully, there is some tiny echogenic foci within this mass, which indicates microcalcifications. In a young patient with testicular mass and microcalcifications may indicate a malignant lesion, but we need to use color Doppler to understand more. Here is another picture and you can see this irregular ill-defined mass with internal tiny calcifications. The overall surrounding regions showed no definite abnormality. Now I have told you about the microcalcifications here but you may not be satisfied with this image quality. So whenever you want to see the microcalcifications you definitely should use different presets which may give you a good result. Like here I have changed my preset and you can see the microcalcifications quite well understandable here. You can also see the irregularity and ill-defined nature quite well. Another view and you can see this irregular mass with internal microcalcifications. Here's the picture. You can see the irregular mass with microcalcifications at the anterior inferior part of the left testis. Now we have put color Doppler. This is very important for us. And on color Doppler, you need to compare the abnormal testis with the normal one. So we have adjusted the color Doppler settings for the normal one. And with similar setting, you can see on the left an increased perilational vascularity. Let's see on real time. Here on real time, you can see prominent disorganized vascularity at the peripheral part. You can also see some internal vessels supplying the mass. Here is another picture with different preset, and you can see prominent vascularity towards the lesion. We have took sample from a feeding artery and you can see a moderate to low resistant flow supplying the lesion. Here we have used power Doppler and you can see prominent peripheral vascularity with some internal vessels also. Here's the picture with an approximate measurement of the lesion and on the right you can see the prominent peripheral vascularity on power Doppler. We have also checked the lesion with elastography and it suggests the lesion to be hard in nature. So, in summary, an irregular ill-defined heterogeneously hypoechoic mass is noted at the anterior inferior pole of the left testicular parenchyma with internal microcalcifications. Predominantly peripheral vascularity is noted on color and power Doppler. So, this feature is concluded as a case of testicular solid mass, possibly of malignant nature. Now, the take-home message. Using different machine presets and transducers may help understand a lesion characteristic much better. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and visit imagingstudy.com for more cases. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.